He was expected to announce his candidacy for the country's upcoming elections. Instead, Hassan Rouhani took to the podium to condemn U.S. action against Syria for a second time. The Syrians must give a response to the terrorists on the battlefield, one that sends a clear message to the Americans that terrorism will not be tolerated and their presence can't continue. The blows that will be dealt to the terrorists will make the U.S. regret its actions. The Iranian president over the weekend also called for an impartial probe into the suspected chemical attack in the war-torn country. A group that includes allies Moscow and Tehran had earlier released a statement warning Washington against further military actions. The United States crossed red lines by attacking Syria. From now on, we will respond to anyone, including America, if it attacks Syria and crosses the red lines. In Italy, as top diplomats from the group of seven major nations convened for their annual meeting on Monday, the Syrian crisis remained a priority. We rededicate ourselves to holding to account any and all who commit crimes against the innocents anywhere in the world. This place will serve as an inspiration to us all. Amid tensions, questions have been raised over Washington's changing strategy over Syria, which may now include regime change.